The third and final day of the inaugural Judo Grand Prix in Upper Austria was set to be filled with excitement, and it didn't disappoint. The local crowd was welcomed by their Olympic medalist Michaela Polares and Shamil Borchasvili, and got to hear from their heroes before the judo was underway. Two veterans of the under 90 kilos contested the day's first final, Christian Toth and Axel Clerge, and showed true values laughing together even while initially disagreeing with who had earned the score. The Hungarian won out, but both were winners here, as they showed why judo is held in such high esteem for its values of friendship and respect. Austrian Member of Parliament Miss Agnes Serka Prama was on hand to award the medals. At under 78 kilos, it was a rematch of the 2021 World Final and former world champion Wagner of Germany looked back to her blistering best, countering Malonga's attack and securing a hold down for the gold medal. She was delighted and celebrated with the local fans. She was awarded her medal by IJF refereeing supervisor Miss Tina Terstenyak. Oh, it was really cool. Uh, a lot of people from my home country come, and also my parents were here, so it was really nice. Uh, nice crowd, and in the final, I also hear to cheering for me, so it was really cool. Brazil's Leonardo Gonçalves was on top form all day. This lightning fast attack in the final against Germany's Luis May, earning him the under 100 kilos gold medal. A great chance for local fans to get the signature of an up-and-coming judo star. He was awarded his medal by IGF refereeing supervisor Mr. Bukmad Mashbat. At over 78 kilos, Takahashi Ruri took gold, transitioning fast to groundwork to secure the win. The medals were awarded by IGF refereeing supervisor Mr. Giuseppe Madaloni. Two-time Olympic champion Lukas Kapalek was back at over 100 kilos, having only competed at under 100 kilos two weeks ago at the World Championships. He took a tactical goal before giving locals a chance to meet a legend. The medals were awarded by IGF head referee director Mr. Armin Bagdasarov. I like uh, the Austrian people, uh, Austrian atmosphere in the Austrian uh, league and this is why I come to here and uh, when, uh, why I com complete here in this competition, you know, because uh, I, I, love, I love, uh, every competition what is in Austria. After Austria took gold yesterday, the home fans were hungry for more medals and the local team didn't disappoint. Thomas Scharfbetter brought the crowd to their feet to end an incredibly successful first event for Austrian judo and the upper Austria area. A cacophony of sound filled with cheers and adulations echoing through the whole of Upper Austria.